Welcome back to MKE Gadgets. Today we're going to talk about tapping and tapping fluids. Here's my collection of tapping fluids I have picked up at local tool shows, Fabtech, and they give them all as samples. And Tap Magic years ago used to come in this can. It's a nice can, but I have some of them that kind of rusted. And then they came in this bottle and then this bottle. And both of them are pretty nice. But the problem I have with these tapping fluids is they're so thin. So here I have a quarter 20 coupling nut and we're just gonna use that as example. It's already been tapped through. So some of these bottles come with this little cap and then you set it down and you lose it immediately. So with this tapping fluid, you put it on a tap and you can see most of it runs off, right? I got a stain down here, I didn't even start tapping. And you put it in there, and then you go tap your hole. So then you want to you know, add a little bit, and you squeeze it on there, and it runs off the tap, and it runs into the, into the hole you're trying to tap. Then there's another company that comes out, Anchor Lube. It has this nice push top bottle here, so you're not going to lose that little red piece that you lose instantly. So you gotta take your acre lube and you really gotta squeeze this. I mean, it barely comes out. I'm really squeezing this hard. So what you do, you end up taking this off because you wanna tap a hole and you just dab it in there. And now look how much you got on there. And that's kind of waste, right? Nice thing about acre lube, if you're tapping over your head on an I-beam, it's not going to run off. It stays put. That's kind of the name, acre lube. So I thought, well, how do I come up with a solution that's kind of a cross between the both of these? So I have this smaller acre lube bottle, and I had to cut the top off pretty big, and I lost that little red cap. And let's put some of this on there. And it flows a lot easier and it stays in place, doesn't fly off. Doesn't run off, and that works out pretty good. So what I did is, I took some Acre Lube and some Tap Magic, and I combined them in this bottle. I'll show you how I did that. You take the top off here, and you squirt in some Tap Magic, Uh, it's pretty, pretty good. And now you got to mix it thoroughly. Well, how do you mix that? So how do I mix that? I take a coat hanger and I cut a hunk off. So you take the piece of coat hanger and you can see that won't fit in there. So you got to bend this loop a little bit. It will fit in that bottle. Okay. Now you need to power this. So you put that coat hanger loop in your cordless drill. Now you put a little bit on there and you can see it, it flows a little bit easier. You don't have to squeeze the bottle so hard. So now you can tap all the way down into your hole and your Tapping fluid stays on there. See how it's staying on there? Let's add a little tapping magic, and you can see it just runs off. So this will work with any tapping fluid. I just happen to have a lot of tap magic, because I got that at the tool show. Now this tapping fluid is kind of interesting. It has this nice spout on it that closes, doesn't get lost. And the cool tool is the same way. Has a nice spout. Tapping fluid doesn't dry out. This one has a flip style. Flips up. I don't know what this is because the label came off, but it's got a little spray bottle. And this is a similar one. You rotate it comes out and you rotate it to close. 
if you ever run into the same problem I experienced here, and you probably have one of these tapping fluids already, get yourself some anchor lube and mix it up. So when I mix this up, the ratio I do is half and half. And it's thick enough if you hold it upside down without squeezing, it's not going to run out. If you drop it over on your workbench or on the floor, it's not going to run out. If you want to add a little more, add a little more. So I really like the acre loop, and it has its place. If you're working over your head on an I-beam and you're tapping on a scissors lift, this is the way to go. But in the machine shop, I feel this is the way to go. A mixture of half acre loop and half my favorite tapping fluid. So this is MKE Gadgets. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please support my channel by subscribing. I'm trying to get to a million subscribers by the end of the year. Thanks, we'll see you tomorrow.